Munich, where we're joined by Mark Lovell. Hi, Mark. So lots of um, mixed expectations coming into this final. What's your assessment of the match? I think uh, the best team won. They've been a, a real force throughout the course of the competition, winning 11 straight matches, you know, and tonight was the fulfillment of a, of a dream, dream season, another treble for Bayern Munich um, coming after 2013. Um, the goal scored, of course, that's his own story by Kingsley Coman, the former PS. PSG youngster came through the academy before joining Juventus. He's uh, really made a name for himself tonight with that precious goal. But, you know, there's so many stories, as your reporter Lance said so well earlier, that uh, this crowns a magnificent season. You have to say it was a deserved win on the night. Um, Manuel Neuer, of course, is returning to the form that saw him, you know, the world's best goalkeeper and won him the World Cup with Germany. He stood out for me tonight. A lot of massive saves. Disappointed with the likes of Neymar and some weak finishing from uh, from him, the Brazilian, and Mbappe, Mbappe. So, you know, so many stories to talk about. I think we could talk about it for half an hour rather than five minutes. Mm -hmm. You're right. Well, Bayern have completed a perfect record winning all their matches in the competition this year. What do you think is the secret behind their success? Well, you have to pay absolute credit to the coach, Hansi Flick, no one expected this when he took over in the beginning of November from, uh, you know, Bayern had just lost 5-1 in Frankfurt. Um, the, the coach, Nico Kovac, was unceremoniously fired the next day. Hansi Flick, who was a member of the Kovac staff, took over as caretaker and started to rebuild immediately. And, you know, he got the dressing room together. The players were happy to play for him. And the culmination came tonight in Lisbon with this Champions League, the sixth European Cup in Bayern's prestigious history. Uh, but Hansi Flick, yeah, he's, he doesn't always get the credit uh, that he deserves, but this is his moment too. Right, Mark Lovell, thanks for your time and thoughts. We appreciate it.